Chris, I'm thinking eight years I've seen you have one bad game. Oh, yeah. <laughs> What do you think it was Antonio yeah. Brown and, and how you beat yourself up? I remember how. Yeah, yeah. I didn't, I didn't have a good game that night, and it was it was tough uh, tough that game. Uh, it was pretty much on me that game. I think we didn't have anybody in our secondary that game. I think both all my safeties are gone, so it was just so it was just, I, it was just me. I think I was out there with Bush and Ko, so that was a hard game, man. But it it, it won't be nothing like that again. <laughs> For this one. Oh yeah, oh yeah. That's definitely motivation, and uh, I try to be consistent every week. Uh, that's one of my main goals. Is this just another game, and uh, try to continue to uh, be consistent. Given the year you had, though, do you embrace this yeah. challenge going ahead? Oh yeah, I mean it's the best versus the best, and it's something that uh, you gotta embrace it. You gotta some. I've, I mean I've had an All Pro receiver every week, so <laughs> it, it doesn't stop, man. So you just gotta continue, like I said, continue to play my game, be consistent, and. I mean, I'm hoping they'll come out with some more turnovers. Why is he so tough? Is it his quickness in and out of routes? What makes him maybe a little yeah. more Yeah. Oh, man, he has great route running. Um, they, let, they let him play. They let him play a little bit at the top of the routes. Um, and then also what he does is Big Ben extends a lot of time for him. And then he can kind of oh, – I'm sorry, he can kind of um, – what do you call it, freelance and just get deep. And a lot of his big plays have come from like freelancing. So I got to do a great job of plastering and uh, knowing that Big Ben's going to extend time and be able to stay on him. How do you combat it when he's yeah. playing at the top of routes? Oh, you just, I mean, I mean, I can't say what I do on the top of routes, <laughs> but uh, you got a little tricks too. So you got to just, just, man, it's, you just got to play your game, man. Don't be scared, compete, and that's what I do every week. Do you have that your shirt specially made? I oh, mean, we just came to our locker and they had these Maha fives on there, so I was like, "Oh yeah, I like this." <laughs> I think you were tweeting a bit during the Rams Chiefs game, but what is your reaction yeah. from a defender's perspective when you see two teams put up that good? Not moment? too many people can deal with Tyree Hill right now. Uh, that's one thing I would say. <laughs> and uh, I mean, nobody's playing defense right now. I mean. Not, well, they're, they're playing defense, but the offensive schemes now are just on a whole nother level. Defensive-wise, we got to try to catch up to them and what they're doing and uh, try to, I guess, reinvent something. But defensive-wise, uh, it's so hard to do that. Uh, you got to have a bunch of guys, man. I, I would say only way you're not giving up t less than uh, 20 points a game, you got to have a full – your whole secondary has to be great, uh, no weak links, and then your D-line has to just be amazing too. I mean, there's some – some talk around the league that, that the rules are such that you can't play defense anymore. Yeah. You, oh, yeah, so definitely, man. I mean, y'all see me cover a guy with my face crooked, and I got called for PI. So, I mean, <laughs> I mean, what else? Is, I mean, that tells you right there, man. I mean, you, you know, we're we're definitely set up to lose for sure. How do you deal with that? I mean, you're an outstanding yeah. defensive player, and they're yeah. setting you up to Try not to get frustrated. I got frustrated a lot last game, so I try to not do that and try to just play my game a little bit more. And uh, like I said, you got to have great technique, great feet, and um, that, that'll keep you away from a lot of those PIs. What is the difference in some of the offenses? I, it looks like they got legal picks. Oh, yeah. On almost every play, is that? Yeah, I mean, they got the pick routes. They got... They got, they're running tons of stuff, Mike. It's crazy, man, what the offense is doing. And uh, it's like they know every call that you're doing, and they run the best route for that call. And uh, I don't know how teams – they just set up this whole season, man. It's been like that. So uh, you just got to continue to just be level-headed as a defense. Know that you can still come out with those turnovers. Like Phillip Rivers, I mean, people might say he had a great game, but look at his turnovers. I mean, we, we're, we're trying to get those picks, force those guys to turnovers. And when those guys throw 40 times, we got to come out with two picks. Roby had a couple PBUs before he got hurt on us. Yeah. How would you think he played? Oh, Roby played outstanding. I think uh, – Played a great game. When I don't, I, I don't think I play my best game. But when I don't play my best game, I need somebody like that to pick me up. That's what Keep do, uh, did. That's what Champ did. Uh, when when if Roby's not playing his game, I got to step up. And that's what you need. So Roby stepped up, had an amazing game, and we need that the rest of the year. You knew that Philip was wasn't going to shy away from you. That he was going to give you some chances. And yeah. Do you have that same uh, approach coming in this week? Thinking oh yeah, definitely. Game? I know I got like 12 to 15 chances to get picks, and my goal is to come out with one or two. You're in a stretch where you face a team that have won five straight, six straight now, I think, six straight again. Yeah. How does that play in the locker room? Does that make yeah. focus easier? That, I mean, it feels like you're playing the best of the best? I mean, we've had a tough game every week. We haven't had no easy games. And uh, we face the top offenses every week. So it's just another top offense that we got to see. 
another great challenge, and we're up for it. I mean, we've seen it all already. So, I mean, now it's just another 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 challenge, another great offense, another great quarterback and receivers, and we got to be ready to play. We've we've had some success this year playing the top offenses. Champ, uh, time for a couple more guys. Final, I mean, the semifinalist, 25 for the Hall of Fame. Oh yeah, he should be here, man. He should be a lock. Uh, just the way he played the game and the amount of plays that he made, it should be easy. So uh, whoever's doing the voting, uh, don't make it too hard, man. It, it should be an easy process right there. <laughs> oh, we got one Hall of Fame voter. <laughs> it shouldn't be too hard, man. <laughs> Try to get Pat in there, too. Pat Bowlin, too, there, man. <laughs> That's just my two requests, man. <laughs> All right. Thanks, Chris. All right. Thanks, Chris.